Hello friends, welcome back. So in this video, I'll be explaining all about capacitor charging and capacitor discharging. In order to explain this capacitor charging and discharging concept, so you would be required a battery that is uh, connected with the switch here. So we have a one switch we call it that switch as a charging switch and that is also connected with the capacitor. So this capacitor, it acts as a storing of power here. When we are going to switch on this switch, what happens is it is going to charge this capacitor. When I am going to switch off this switch, what happens is by the time this capacitor will have enough energy is getting stored here. Now what we are going to do is we are going to remove this battery out of this circuit. When the battery is getting removed, what happens is here this charging cycle will stop here. And whatever the capacitor which is used here that is stored with certain amount of voltage here so in order to use this capacitor what we have to make use of is you have to use discharge switch if i switch on this discharge switch what happens is this led is going to glow until this cycle is keep happening until this capacitor is drained until that time this LED is going to glow. So now I'm going to demonstrate how this capacitor charging or discharging is really is going to happen. For that, in order to explain this capacitor charging and discharging, so what I should do is, so I'll be connecting this battery to this circuit. Now I'm going to connecting this uh, battery to this circuit. Once the connection is done, what I should do is I should switch on this. So if I keep pressing this charging, so that means the light is blown and that capacity is getting charged. Now I switched off that uh, switch here. So now what happens is this circuit of charging cycle is done and uh, there is a energy is getting stored in the this capacitor. Now what I will do is I will remove this battery out of this. That indicates there is no power is connected to this circuit. Now, only thing is there is a voltage is getting stored in this power is getting stored in this capacitor. Now I wanted to see whether capacitor is really stored something or not. So how will we check? We can check that by using this discharge switch. So now I'm going to press the discharge switch and see there is a LED light is going to glow here because that is tells us there is a capacitor is getting charging is happening and also discharging is also happening. Now look onto this. Now when I'm switching this uh, discharge switch, now if you can see right, the electricity is uh, uh, getting dim. That means it is discharging. Now it is completely got drained. This capacitor, whatever it is getting stored, it got stored, that got discharged by making use of this discharge switch button. Now, I hope you guys got a clarity what is all about uh, capacitor charging cycle as well as what is all about uh, capacitor discharge cycle. I hope uh, you guys got a clarity. If you guys really like this video, please click on like button as well as share it with your friend so that they will also get the benefit out of this video. Thanks for watching this video. Bye for now. Take care.